Hey, Chels. Oh. What you doing? Hello. Looking at recipes for dinner. For recipes, huh? You wouldn't uh, happen to know what day it was or anything like that, would you? Well, I think it might be. What's up, guys? And welcome back to another episode of a Super Cooper Sunday. Good boy, Coop. What are you doing? You're waiting for dinner, too? You're hungry? I have no food. You're that hungry? Oh, my goodness. Coda's here sniffing my ear. What's up, buddy? What's up, guys? And welcome back. This week... We have a fun episode planned. I'm actually excited for this, and this is gonna be the first time that Chelsea has been involved in this type of sneakiness. So last time we did this, I was the only one that was home. But uh, you guys may remember from last week, the Slip Inside episode, Cooper left me a little surprise. Roll the clip. What can he, so he can see right here? He can see what? that we're here. He can see the corner of the tart, but he can't tell what else is going on. I'll show you something. You just gotta come here. You're in trouble. I don't know. We might just have to cancel oh, this episode. No. So did he do an F you poo? Who did it? I think he pee peed too. Kooby, come here. Who? Who did it? Who Cooper, who did, did that? This? Who did that? Who's a naughty boy? Cooper. That wasn't funny, Cooper. It wasn't <laughs> nice that you did that. It was not funny at all. Look, he's still guilty. Technically, we don't know for sure that Cooper did that. Technically, we don't know 100%. We know, judging by the size of the gift, that it was probably him. This back here is my office where I work all day. And for the most part, we kind of have this invisible barrier that they know they're not supposed to come through. Cooper will sometimes, especially in the morning when he and Chelsea get up and he wants to come downstairs and see me, and that's fine. Coda, the barrier is especially solid, and it makes me feel bad because Coda's the one that wants to see me the most but he just drops hair everywhere and it gets all on the PC and causes issues and stuff. So technically Kodo won't even go in the office half the time. He's like, he knows he's not supposed to be in there. Cooper doesn't really listen to the rules all the time. So we have a pretty good suspicion that it's Cooper that keeps doing this. But today we're gonna be taking the boat out and we're gonna find out exactly who the mystery pooper is. So check this out guys. We have two GoPros set up on the go fetch mounts so we're going to mount these bad boys on the boys i've got another camera set up over here i've got a camera set up here in the back and then i'm also going to have a camera rolling in my office and we're going to see if we can catch the mystery pooper so the reason why we have so many cameras set up and we aren't just rolling off of these is because i don't know how long these are going to stay on sit good boy i don't know if coda has ever i mean he wore one very briefly in that one episode but he didn't necessarily love it, so we'll see what happens here. Coda, gonna... you're so big. <laughs> look at, look yeah. how long it has to be. Hook this thing in. Yeah, if you guys can see, they're different lengths. I gave him the extra long one just because I know he has a big head that we have to try to see over. He just so, wants to kiss you, please. One goes around the leg. Let's go ahead and turn you on, buddy. And boom, there you go. All right. Does he even know what's on there? I don't know if he does. Good boy, Coda. Good boy, that's nice. He always puts his head down because it's so big and heavy. I don't know if we're really going to be able to see much by him looking at the floor. So. Coda, that's a good boy. And he runs underneath the table. We're screwed. You're handsome. <laughs> we're kind of getting oh. a little bit a little bit crooked here. Do we need to tighten this up some? I don't want to make it too Coopy, tight. Coopy, you just knocked the whole camera with his big old head. Coop. Good boy. Well, I'm sorry about this footage, guys. Cooper right. keeps walking underneath me and Coop, knocking here. the camera. You're good boy. Again. <laughs> hey, good boy, it's all right. It's okay, Coda. It's, it's all right. Good job, Take Coop. It's all right. Out. He's all right, Coda. Put this one in here. He, Coda, he's okay. Get it up. He's okay, buddy. You're wearing Put the same thing. Here. You're good. Good boy, Coop. Oh, goodness. Well, we're going to get nice, slow, smooth footage oh. out of one. Hey, Cooper, Cooper. <laughs> We're gonna get nice, slow, smooth footage out of one, and we're gonna get crazy, all over the place footage out of the other one. Really bumpy. Good boy, come here. Come on, show me your GoPro, good boy. Don't try to knock it off. You're a good boy, you're a good boy. Okay, let's get out to the boat. All right, girl, are you ready? Are we gonna find the mystery pooper? I don't know, it might, it might take us a couple of tries, but I feel like it's pretty consistent. I, it's gotta be. I, I hope we find it on the first try, so watch out, boys. Watch, Coda, you're already crooked. I just tried, he's just, he's just, just crooked. 
You're, you're just a crooked dog. Okay, here we go. Everybody stay. else has to stay home. Just stay. <laughs> he Sorry. is telling you off right Bye. now. Cooper, chill. Be good boys. They're already very it. unhappy about it. Here we go. Look at our grass. It's coming up through the dock. Yeah, our we need to get in? that get that taken care of. She's getting us untied. Looks like our neighbor Chase is having a little bonfire. Mm -hmm. Things going pretty good. His fire looks like it's escaped the pit there. I saw him throwing gasoline on it, so well, he's do it. he's having a good time. Uh, Cooper's in the left sack. I can see him. <laughs> I don't know if you guys can see, but he's in the love sack. He's getting in trouble. <laughs> Where's Coda? Maybe he's the culprit. I'm starting to wonder. He disappeared real fast. This is truly a mystery. What if Dakota is the culprit? And we just always assumed it was Cooper. Would you feel up bad? Oh no, I see Coda. He was just napping. I saw, just saw him stand up. I would feel really bad. They're both in there the window. There they are. Oh, they look so cute. Boys. There they are, guys. If you can see them standing there. We're leaving you. <gasps> oh, oh, I no, thought he was going back. towards the back. I'm seriously curious. When we get out of eyesight, what he's going to do. chill here around the corner and give him a couple minutes and we'll see what happens. Just hanging out, going for a leisurely boat ride, knowing that our our two wonderful, beautiful, good boys at home are gonna protect the house, and they're gonna be good. Mm. They're not gonna sleep in the love sack. They're most oh. definitely not gonna poop in my office. He's already been in the love sack. Sometimes you guys, he gets in the love sack, and he'll stay in the love sack until we get off of the boat, and then like he'll he stares get out. at us. Yeah, and then he'll get out and lay next to it, like been here the whole time. <laughs> He's got to do it when we're gone. Oh, 100%. <laughs> That's why I'm excited to see this footage. Cover's bringing us in. Upon arrival, oh, one has just emerged. Which one? I see a small golden boy. Oh, the golden is the first one. When we first got here, we could see no dogs. But Coop just came from like back by the stairs in the kennel. So he could have been upstairs? He could have been having a poo. That's a dangerous could have been having spot a rest. to be. He looks very cute. Hello, buddy. Hello. Oh, your GoPro is completely sideways. Coda, what were you doing? Coda, what were you doing? You weren't on the couch, were you? Your GoPro at least is still upright. Let's see the moment of truth. Are you behind me, Charles? Let's go see what's going on in here. Huh. No, no dice. Mm. No poos. All right, well, attempt number one didn't work out, but I think we're just gonna go right back out and pick up where we left off. We're gonna give him a little bit more time this time. All Coda wants to do is go back to bed. I just want you guys to know that Coda has not moved since we came back in the house. <laughs> we went over, we turned the GoPro off, we readjusted it, we turned it back on, and he hasn't moved an good inch. boy. Oh my goodness. All right, so we're gonna go back out. We're gonna give him a little bit more time this time. Hopefully it works. Let's get going. Oh. 
Run, darling. The boat, the boat is leaving. My legs are only so long. Come on. No, seriously. You gotta come. Come on. I can't make that. Oh, yes, you can. My legs are not that long. That would have been funny. Oh, man. Yeah, if I wiped out. All right. One of us would have thought it was funny. Koopy is shaking and baking. Oh, he's oh. walking towards the office. Nope, he took her. Oh, he's going upstairs. <laughs> What do you think Coop's doing? Well, I can't see him. He's probably still up the stairs. He's, he's probably waiting to see if that's going to be a better angle. So we're going to cruise around for a good like 10 minutes this time and just let him do his thing. Hang out. We'll enjoy this. I mean, the I, sun's currently I mean, setting right now. Yeah. Doesn't really get a whole lot better than this, or it's about to set at least. So Gorgeous. we're just gonna cruise around and hopefully he's gonna do his thing. I'm gonna be real mad if whoever does it doesn't do it this one time that we're trying to catch him. I'll be so mad. Watch him do it like tomorrow. Oh. <laughs> I don't think you guys understand. There's like any time that I leave my office door open and we come out here on the boat, there's like a 90% success rate for the mystery pour. Oh, I would say at least. Like there have been like one or two times where it hasn't happened, but 90% of the time it does. So hopefully they do it again. We have made it all the way over to the other side of the lake. I feel like that's some pretty ample time. If somebody's trying to be... And we're completely out of sight. So oh yeah, you, you can hardly even see the house back there, so. There's no worries of us like possibly coming back now. So right, we, so we're, we're gonna cruise like this all the way back. That should give us plenty of time. If yeah. somebody's gonna make any moves, they're gonna make moves and we'll see what happens. Almost back home. It's been like 15 or 20 minutes. They had to have done it. Koopy, were you a good boy? His it, it's sideways and pointed at the ceiling. Koda's over there. All right. Hold on, Koopy, come here. Koda's gonna have to How long? footage. How long? 23 minutes. 23 minutes and 21 seconds. That's how long we were gone. We're gonna shut off all these cameras. I don't smell any perpetrators so far, but that's not a guarantee. Here we go. Were you naughty? Was anybody naughty? Nope. Nothing? They know. It's got to be that he knows. You know, babe, I've just, I've reviewed all the footage and I've come to one conclusion, okay? We simply have the best boy in the world and he wouldn't poo in the office. That's what it comes down to. Someone is Listen, look. In the office. He would tell you that same thing. He Someone he wouldn't is do it. Doing it. It's not me. I cannot believe that he didn't do it. Like I'm 
Part of me is really happy because, I mean, let's pretend what if this was the end of the office pooper and he just never did it again. That would be really nice. I feel like that's not gonna happen. But uh, man, I showed her a couple of the clips and I honestly don't know if we're gonna be able to enjoy the boat anymore. I don't think we're ever gonna be allowed to leave the house again. I'm worried that he has some separation anxiety or something because Coda just acts like if we fell off the end of the earth, he wouldn't care. Yeah. He would just sit there. He literally did not leave the couch. Meanwhile, Cooper is running all around the house just crying. Oh, poor buddy. I'm so sorry. So, sweet. so I feel like we have more evidence that he's the one that does it. I don't know if we, we fully told you guys the, the severity of the situation. It seriously happens all the time. Like I, I want to, to know for a fact who it is and I'm pretty sure it's Coop, but we still don't have concrete solid evidence he's yet. so sad, please love him forever. Came up with a really good idea why you don't think he did it. Do you want to tell the people? Oh, I think it's because he saw the cameras out and so he just thought, he assumed he was going. Ever since he was a puppy, he has always known the cameras that I have. He knows the noises they make when they start up and want to hit the record button and stuff. So I, I totally agree with you. I think that's a great idea. He knows it means that he's going to play or swim or get a new tree or something. I think he saw the camera and just knew that he was coming along. And that's probably why yeah. he was all extra sad throughout all that footage. At least that's what I'm going to hope. There's that meme that you see sometimes. And every time I see it, it makes me want to cry. It's like that a dog is just a small part of your life, but you're their entire life. And stuff like this just really puts that in perspective. Like he ran around for probably 40 minutes that we were recording this video, the two times that we went out, just crying for us. So, yeah, no more vlogs, no more gaming videos. I'm just gonna spend the rest of my life just cuddling on the floor with this guy. <laughs> We well, might have uh, to get carpet if we're gonna do we'll, that. We'll never see you guys again. No, but seriously, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Man, it just, ah. Every time you see something like that, it really kind of humbles you and brings things into perspective. He's such a good boy. They're both such good boys, even though I think if we never came back, he wouldn't mind. He'd be like, Where's Until the food? he got hungry. Where's the food? That's, no, that's about food. it. No. Meanwhile, Cooper would be crying over our graves forever. So anyway, hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. I know it wasn't really what you expected. I was hoping to be able to catch him in the act, but we didn't make it happen. If you guys want more like this with like the GoPros on the dogs, leaving home, first person perspective type stuff, we could definitely do that. I would still like to try to catch him. So if you guys want to see that, let us know, drop a like in the video and we'll just start putting GoPros on the dogs every time we leave. And eventually we're for sure gonna catch it. Cause like I said, it happens most of the time. So drop a like if you guys enjoyed. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'm sorry if Cooper kind of pulled on your heartstrings a little bit. He's <laughs> such a sweetheart. Oh, man. Such a lovey dovey. Oh my goodness. Coda, I love you too. Even though I feel like it's not reciprocated quite as much, but I still love you. And uh, we're gonna see you guys next Sunday. Thanks for watching guys. Peace out. Thank you.